Everything in an airport does not cost money. There are freebies in an airport. If this is something you're interested in, stay tuned because I'm going to tell you what is free in an airport. Hey fellow travelers, this is Norman Payne from Up, Up, Up and Away. Today I'm going to tell you about freebies in an airport. I know once you get into an airport, the money starts flowing out of your pocket. It is a spending fest. Everything you think of starts costing money. You just start spending, spending, spending. And don't have a layover. If you have a layover, you start spending even extra money. But there are some freebies in the airport. And I'm going to tell you about those freebies that you can get in an airport. So. Take note, free water. There is free filtered water in the airport. So if you bring your own water container, you can fill up your water bottle. You don't have to purchase a bottle of water out of one of those small stores for five or six dollars a shot. You can fill up your own bottled water. I usually take mines with me and I like to my water a little cold, so I bring ice with me. Yes, it will get through TSA. So you can bring your bottled water with ice cubes in it and you can have cold water while you're waiting on your flight. I also get bottled water before I get off the flight from the flight attendant and I top my bottle off then too. So I have water the entire time I'm on the flight, I'm waiting on the flight, and when I go through the airport on the other side, I fill the bottle up again. I stay hydrated for free. I don't have to buy water from a store and spend those crazy prices on bottled water. Airport tours. Do you know that airports have tours? So if you have a layover or say you have some type of delay in your flight, you can take an airport tour. You have to ask for it. It's not something that's posted, but you can take an airport tour. And some of the really, really nice airports, those tours are great. And it's a way of killing time if you're stuck in an airport. But you have to go to that information center and ask about it. They're not just telling everybody about it. But go ask if you're ever stuck in an airport, ask about an airport tour. And they're free. If you're in an airport, don't go buy a magazine. They have libraries in a lot of airports. Also, go to the information. Ask them about the library. You can check out books and you can even do book swaps. You can carry that book to the next airport sometimes. Go and check that out. Free books. Go read something while you're waiting on your flight. And sometimes you can even take it on the plane with you and, and return it to the next flight. Or you can bring it back to the same airport if you want to take it on your trip with you. Go check it out. Free airport libraries. Religious services. Do you know that a lot of airports have religious services going on? Different denominations all the time. Go check it out. You can go and worship while you're waiting on your plane and it's for free. Of course they will accept any donation that you give, but there are services going on in a lot of airports. All you have to do is go look for it, but it's there for free. Doggy parks. Do your dog need a break as well? You can take your dog to doggy parks. I know Hartsville Jackson has a nice doggy park. You can take your dog out there, let your dog run around for a few minutes or whatever, and you can do this if you have a connected flight, as long as you have a boarding pass. Be sure that your boarding pass is active to get back through TSA. Sometimes that's a hassle for people to have to go back through TSA. But if you got pre-check, it's a snap. But doggy parks, 
and you might even meet some people. It's a nice place to meet other people, other travelers. So, doggy parks, completely free. Take your dog out, let your dog get some fresh air. Meet some other dogs. Luggage tags. You can get luggage tags at any airline's check-in desk. You pick an airline's, they got luggage tags. If you forgot to put luggage tags on your luggage, you need luggage tags on your bags. So, luggage tags for free. Just go ask. You can get them put on by any airlines. If you go to some of the international airlines, they got really nice luggage tags. Some people even collect these things. So, go check that out. Go to an international desk, ask them for luggage tags, see what they hand you. And they're free. They're not going to charge you for them. Of course, most airports have free Wi-Fi. All you have to do is sign your name and your email address. They don't send you any marketing material or anything like that. What they're doing is tracking how powerful they need their Wi-Fi. So you can sign up to free Wi-Fi and stay connected to all of your friends and social media and news outlets and all of that stuff for free. You don't have to use your own data if you're paying for a data plan. Get on their free Wi-Fi in the airport. Charging stations. They do have charging stations in both airports. You have to find them and sometimes they're being hogged up by several different people. But they do have free charging stations. I do suggest that you not operate your device while you're charging. So turn your device off and let it charge. If you're charging it and operating and surfing the web at the same time, sometimes there's a scam going on where these people are setting up things to get into your, your, your device by uh, going through these charging stations. But do not operate the device, turn it off, let it charge, and then you're good to go. But they do have charging stations in the airport for free so check those out samples an airport is a great source of people selling things so there are sometimes people giving samples out so if you're if you're in an airport and you and you gotta kill time sometimes i don't like to just sit at my gate and wait if i'm if my plane's delayed so i like to wander around so sometimes there's people out giving out samples. Walk around. If you're in Hartsville, Jackson, you don't know how many samples you can come back with after you've walked around a concourse or two. Uh, e even food, you can get samples of food and, and perfume and, and just different things. So walk around. There are people out giving out free samples of different things in the airport. Fragile stickers. So, fragile stickers you can get at any check bag counter or any airlines. They give these fragile stickers. I know you've seen them on boxes and everything and you can put them on your luggage. Now, I'm not saying that that's going to stop those guys from throwing your luggage around. It might make them think about it while they're throwing your luggage around but you can put a fragile sticker on your suitcase to kind of minimize them from pitching your luggage on the ground like they do like i said it ain't gonna stop them that's just what they do just keep in mind some of these things vary from airport to airport and it's per availability so you might not find some things in one and some things in another, but check them out. There are free things in an airport. You don't have to spend for everything that you see in an airport. There are some freebies there. Do you know of any cool free things that you can get? If you do, leave it in the comment section below. Let me know what kind of cool and free things that you come across in the airport that you go to frequently or any of them that you've been to when you visit a different destination. Let me know about them. Well, that's all I have for you today. If you are not a subscriber, then you know what to do. 
hit that subscribe button that's right here. Become a subscriber today, and our paths will cross again soon. And I'll see you next time. Peace. And please like this video, share it, and subscribe to my channel. Also follow me on all my social media. Just hashtag up 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 Norman, where you will find my Facebook page, my Instagram account, my Twitter page, and my TikTok page.